welcome back. It's been 35 years since Killin' Time topped the charts. That song launched Clint Black as one of the biggest new stars in country music. Now he's bringing back the album to celebrate its anniversary. So Clint, cool. welcome back yes. to the album. Oh man, good to see you too. Hi Clint, you have so many hits on your Killin' Time album and now you're on tour performing them all over again. How does this tour feel different decades later than the first one? Well, we are doing songs from that album that we haven't done in 35 years. You know, we've always done the hits, uh, give or take one or two. Uh, but now we're doing from track one all the way through 10, uh, the whole album in order. Wow. And I feel a different reaction from the audience before they get there tweeting at me and stuff and, uh, and at the show. And it felt funny at first, like, you know, I'm not sure they want to hear every song from that album. They do. Reaction was fantastic, and I don't always sense it because I'm busy changing guitars or getting a different harmonica into my brace and and listening for the count off. But I was able to, I was able to feel it. That's amazing. Cl Speaking of that, Clint, do you feel pressure to just play your hits when you're at a concert? Because as an audience, we're like, just play the hits, man. <laughs> yeah, the, the, the good thing is I, I have too many to do them all in one show. <laughs> And so someone's always going to be disappointed. I've had people get mad, you know, that I didn't do Desperado, which wasn't <laughs> even a hit for me. It was quasi hit. That's a jam. Uh, that is a I jam. Yeah, I, I always do uh, at least one or two deep cuts. Nice. Uh, they seem to be fan favorites. They get a great reaction. So we do them. I'm just going to put it out on the table. If I came to see you and you didn't perform Desperado, <laughs> I'd be very <laughs> That is such a great song. You did Desperado about it. <laughs> like, I, had like, a guy, I, I had a guy down front that was just really, really <laughs> mad about it. And, and, and we were already walking off the stage with this guy. It's over. That was my brother. I'm really, really sorry. <laughs> so, killing time completely changed the trajectory of your career. Do you remember when you realized life was going to be different? I do. I remember the exact moment I was driving by this, I have to say it, a crappy little bar. It was just a hole in the wall and a little strip center and uh, not some place I wanted to play every night. And I was driving past it after Better Man and Killing Time had gone number one. And I remember in a flash just realizing that it, in, in my hometown, Houston, Texas, it would never be the same for me. Wow. Walking in that bar or any other bar I played, my life had changed. And I remember feeling a, a little remorse. I, wow. I, wouldn't, I wouldn't have changed anything because right. my dreams were coming true. But I remember lamenting that I, I have left something behind that I can never go back to. How wow. amazing That's to awesome. know in the really moment. I know. Yeah, it is. In the moment. Okay, so you're part of a generation of country stars marked by their cowboy hats. Can you go incognito without your signature look? <laughs> I can, and it, it really depends on which part of the country I'm in, you know, around my, uh, where I live in Nashville, I go everywhere. and. Yeah, I think people are maybe tired of seeing celebrities, but uh, you know, if I'm in Norman, Oklahoma, I might uh, I might stand out a little more. <laughs> and uh, and a, a lot of times, I'm I'm told it's it's the smile that gave me away. Mm -hmm. If I'm walking past someone in a grocery store and smile, oh, I know that smile. Mm -hmm. even if <laughs> that. That's a good thing. I'd recognize that cute face anywhere. Oh, yeah. Guy. So sweet. <laughs> My so sweet. You, Clint, you are, you literally have filled us all up. Totally. So thank you. And thank you for stopping you by. DBL Nation, you can find Killing Time tour dates and locations at clintblack.com slash tour. You can also purchase Raising a Hand coffee table photo books by Clint's brother in Ooh. support of Rett Syndrome Research at raisingahand.com. That is amazing. And as we go into a break, let's hear another one of your hits. Desperado. <laughs> Thanks again, Clint. Thanks. You guys are a blast. Yeah. Thank you, sir. Okay. I know I'm leaving here, better man. Knowing you this way, things I couldn't do more now. I think I can, and I'm leaving here, better.
better man.